Hey guys, and welcome back to our adventures in Minecraft. As always, I'm Demonfire93, and last episode we were... Well, right, really for the last three episodes, we've been on a journey to map out the area. As you can see, we have the largest uh, version of a map. Okay, this is dangerous. I'm going to do it anyways for the viewers. Woo! All right. I hope that I, that the water still worked and that one deep water would not kill me. But uh, we decided that this was very much way too large. I mean, it was very, 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 very large. And uh, so I decided that this what we explored last episode is enough. And uh, we shall head on home. <clears throat> Before I uh, cut away at all, I wanted to talk to you guys a bit. Uh, last episode I was talking, I think it was either last one or part two, but I'm pretty sure it was last one, that I was uh, talking about Seth MacFarlane and crappy television. Now, I was meaning animation in general, not just television in general. I mean, animation is just crap nowadays. No television show that is animated is really good that I have been able to find. <clears throat> Every single new animated show since 2008 on any of the like cartoon networks. So, I mean, those are Cartoon Network, Nickelodeon, and Disney. None of them came out with anything good since 2008. My personal opinion. Um, and... But other than that, there are still some good actual television shows that are, I mean, like, you know, live shows and everything. I mean, I watch on a weekly basis The Walking Dead. That is a fantastic show. I've been with it from the very beginning and actually bought all the books and read them as well. So I've got both worlds and get to find out the differences between them. Uh, I watch Gotham on a weekly basis. The Gotham has grown on me. I didn't like it at first because I am a pretty big Gotham fan. Uh, whoops. Yeah. Pretty big uh, Batman kind of fan here yeah so <laughs> you know I was definitely looking forward to that when I heard that it was coming out and then the first episode they were just really really trying to pile everything they could into one episode go really really fast and rush the story along and it was just way too much for the first episode and I think that they found that out and they started slowing it down as the episodes went on and like I said that because of that it's grown on me though like I said the first episode I was just I was not having it because there was some stuff that is in the whole DC universe of Batman and everything that they screwed up those of you who read the comics and everything and know a lot about Batman, you know where I'm coming from. But, you know, that's alright. You can't expect them to go directly by the book. I mean, it's been rewritten so many times. I also watch uh, Bones. Bones is another good one. I mean, shows where they're actually have they actually have a really good plot and they're not just trying to be funny and everything I've never gotten into the, uh, the Big Bang Theory my parents watch it and uh, they'll have it on sometimes and I'll just sit there and I'll listen in it's like okay that's a little funny here and there but I have not been interested in it enough to actually watch a full episode at all so I don't know. Um, I have no place to actually judge that one, really. But yeah, most cartoon shows that came out, I gave them a try. 
and then immediately went, well, this is crap. This is literally just screaming at a, the screen for 30 minutes and doing stupid shit. And now, like, Cartoon Network has begun to allow swearing and everything. And it's like, what the hell? You're not allowed to swear. You're Cartoon Network. You're for little kids. Or at least you were when I was growing up. You're for kids. And you cannot have swearing. You have little blocks of time that are allotted for older audiences, and those can have the swearing. But when it's just regular Cartoon Network, you are not allowed. Because little kids should not be learning that language until they are older. I mean, the only exception that I found is uh, hilariously the book Go the Fuck to Sleep. Oh my god, I laughed my ass off when I first heard about that book. Um, and we talked about it in my English class, and I believe I've already talked about it in another episode. But yes, Go the Fuck to Sleep. An amazing, amazing book. Children's book. And that's the thing, is that they're like, oh my gosh. I mean, they're, they're t they were taking the same perspective that I am on this stuff now. Where it's like, oh my gosh, swearing, you can't swear in front of kids. Well, some kids grew up with that in their household, and so that's normal for them. And so that comforts them to go to sleep like that. Having their parents say, go the fuck to sleep. But in television, that should still not be the case. <clears throat> my personal opinion you guys can leave yours in the comments if you want to you can hate me for not liking shows like Adventure Time and Total Drama whatever the hell they're on now and whatever else has come out I mean when Adventure Time first came out, I gave it a try, and I just... I would rather have bashed my head into a goddamn wall than watched that for an extended period of time. It just was brainless dribble. So, enough with that. I wanted to get a little bit of, uh... anger out of me. <laughs> I needed to vent a little bit because I just got finished with my last episode of Five Nights at Freddy's 2. I have 30 minutes from last night recording it and 40 minutes from tonight recording it. And you know what I got accomplished in all that? Absolutely nothing. Spoiler alert. But that will actually be coming out. That will have already come out before this. So, where is my house? I could have sworn it was around here somewhere. I'm lost again, guys. Damn it. Oh, hey, creepers. Aha! You blew each other up. Dumb asses. Yeah, so I literally just spent the last 40 minutes screaming at my computer into the mic. I probably peaked the mic a couple times. So that'll be interesting to see. <laughs> I was getting so pissed because it's just so much bullshit with that game. Sometimes you do really well, other times you do terribly. It's all about luck, and my luck has never been good. It's like another game that I would like to play for you guys eventually. A little game I like to call Faster Than Light, FTL. Oh, hey. Um, that creeper wasn't... Okay. But, yeah, FTL played it so long ago and for such a long amount of time. And... It took me, I don't know how many months. Hold on, actually, I can I can actually check. Here, let me just get on this island here. And you know what? We don't even have to stop the recording to do this. So we're just going to get on this island here. 
I realize where we are now, by the way. All right, so we're going to do this. So apparently it did have a difference, actually. My bad. Um, 22 hours I've played in Faster Than Light. Uh, I didn't realize that by minimizing my game that it would stop recording, and so I read that to you guys, because I thought I was recording, and then got back into the game and walked back to the house, and, you know, just now realized, hey, I'm not recording. What the hell? So 22 hours in FTL, and that last hour of that probably is actually me beating it on the easiest difficulty in the game because and before you even had the advanced mode and everything this was back when it was the original version on easy difficulty so they didn't have the advanced race the newer races and everything and all the new events that could happen and all the different whatever mechanics for those of you who don't know what fast what fast and light is it's a really fun space game really aggravating too but it has to do all with luck because it's all about hey how lucky are you you go to this sector and oh hey there's a fire are you gonna help the people sure oh you lost one of your crew members now you've only got two all right go to the next area and oh hey uh you got these people boarded the ship and start attacking your people and oh you lost another person so now you've only got one crew member sorry and then you get um another one where you'll go to the next sector and it's like oh hey you need to do this and it's just a series of either good events happening to you or a series of bad events happening to you or a combination of both and in my case it was always bad so when it comes to games where you have to do have a lot of luck I suck at them which is why I'm conceding defeat on Five Nights at Freddy's 2 because I just could not beat night six it was just not possible and I I understand my limitations. I stopped before I was about to uh, destroy anything and said, okay, I'm done. I'm not even going to try anymore. I'm at my wit's end here. I mean, I'm, I'm at my sanity's end. I'm at every end that I possibly could be. And so instead of continuing with this torture on myself, I'm going to just stop and... Uh, Let's record something that's actually fun. And so we came to Minecraft. Minecraft. Nope, nope, bad spider, bad spider. So. All right. You go ahead and just sink then. What, you, just cause you're sitting? I'm being attacked by something, you idiots. Aren't you still supposed to do something? What's the matter? You don't like my uh, wolves there, Skelly? But they're not good enough for you? Creeper, don't come up behind me. Not while I'm doing this. Then I might actually rage quit. After everything else that's piled on today, I think I would. I would lose my mind if that creeper had come over and attacked me. I'm gonna go for these endermen here. <clears throat> and then we're gonna go look for some cows. <coughs> Cause I wanna bake a cake. <coughs> oh god. I'm sorry. Yeah, I wanna get back to uh, our objectives. Which one of which? What? He was just in the water for like five seconds and didn't do anything. Well, not five seconds, but he was in there for a couple seconds and he didn't try and run. Did they change Enderman again? By the way, going on that uh, episode a while back where I said that they had taken out the glaring sound thing. They actually didn't, but it's not in there as often or as loud. Seriously, what the hell? Why do creepers have to blow up so early too? 
What's up, Skelly? Oh, hey. Hey! No! Oh, shit. Let's look at him. Let's look at him. Come on. Enderman. See, they don't do anything anymore. I don't know what the heck they did to Enderman. But it's not working. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, cows. You better not come back and attack me later. Because that's just bullshit. So we're looking for cows. So we can get one of our achievements. Which is to bake a cake. Ow! Alright. So where would the cows be? Well, they'd be anywhere in any biome. Any biome can have cows. Damn it. Not any biome, right? You guys will probably be able to tell me in the comments below what biome they can't be in. It's been a while since I've been in Minecraft. They're pretty much found in most biomes, though. I mean, I would guess they wouldn't be in... I mean, obviously not Mushroom Islands. They wouldn't be in there. They wouldn't be in... Deserts. Ah! Cow! Thank you, cow. Do you have... A... Significant other? I had to think of the word. <gasps> you do! And I have wheat. Alright. We're gonna bring this cow. Where'd he go? Cow! There you go. And apparently we're also gonna bring the sheep. Come on, cow. Come on, cow. We gotta bring you two together. We're bringing you back to the house so we can make ourselves a barn. Or something of that sort. Come on, cow. Hey, stupid cow. Oh, God. Don't do that. Don't you know I scare easily? Hey, stupid cow. Thank you. Don't mind me. I'm just going to eat this uh, steak in front of you guys. Delicious. Oh, is that your brother? That's pos that possibly could have been your brother. Cows! What is your problem with following me? I have wheat. You want wheat. Wheat will make you love. Wheat will make you breed. You want wheat. You must have it. So follow me. God, it's like the wolves all over again. They just want to go kill the damn skeletons. They don't care about anything else. Come on. These ones are just stupid and don't care about anything. They just... Damn, wander around. Come on. Jump. Jump. Oops. Damn it. Cow! Oh my god. As if one cow wasn't stupid enough. We have to get two. Come on, cow. Come on, cow. Come on, cow. Hey, idiot cow. Go around it. It's that simple. It's not rocket science. You walk around the tree. Apparently we're just gonna pick up all the sheep on our way there, too. That's fine. Oh my god, we can pick, we can start making a rainbow of 16 colors. Come on, cow. What the heck? How are they? I don't even. 
I don't understand. Come, come on, cow. Come on, cow. There you go. Come on, cow. Are you a cow? No, you are a sheep. You are not needed. There you go. Cow number two. Jump. There you go. It's rocket science for cows. All right, so we're going to cut away and we'll bring you guys back once we get to back to the house with these guys. We'll see how many of them actually survive. Where's the house, by the way? I don't even know anymore. Great. I lost them. I lost interest. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to lose your interest. Please come back. Hey, cow. Pay attention to me. You know what? You guys can just stay in that pond. All right. No, 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 don't, don't trample my melons. All right, so you want to apparently be here. Apparently you do too. Okay. Um. Stay. Come back and uh, you asshole, you're dying. You are dying now. You, you just. You die. That is your punishment for what you did. And you know what you did. You broke my goddamn mallet. Will you... Go, go away. Just go away. Alright. So let's get some of these. And we'll throw that away. And we'll do that. And we'll do this. And... Yeah. We kind of got the cows here. Um. Alright. You know what? That can despawn for all I care. Real quick. Gotta go get... Just you, you, you two cows stay put. Don't you worry. I'll be back. Stupid cows. Alright. You need... No, wait. Hold on. I need more of that before I do this. Here we go. <clears throat> Back to the house. Where we will drop some stuff off, pick some stuff up, do some other stuff. Did I just hear that Enderman again? Okay, so we're going to get a full stack of that. Put that away. Uh, put that in there. I don't remember what I was coming in here for. Sure. Let's do that. Okay. <clears throat> oh, I do remember what I was coming in here for. And it had nothing to do with coming actually to the house. But I did need to empty my inventory a little bit. So I had a little bit to do with coming to the house. So. We are going to come back here. Where the creeper exploded. And we're going to take these down. I kind of needed that. Damn it. All right. Yoink. 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 Yeah, five of them. That should be plenty. Yeah. Don't need any more than five. No. Why would we ever need more than that? You guys like that area? Is that it? All right. Well, I'm gonna make this your area then. I don't know why I grabbed these fences then. If I'm just gonna dig this out, I was gonna make a fenced-in area for them. Yeah, you guys come in here. All right. Smart cow. Smart cow. Hey, cow. Yeah, you see this? You see this? You want it, don't you? You want it, huh? I know you want it. Come on. You can do it. You're so close. You're so close. Just a little bit further. Let's go, cow. 
Let's go, cow! Let's go, cow! Oh, so close! So close! Come on, cow! Into the little hut here. Come on, you can do it. Oh, you, you, what the? You can just go to hell, you stupid cow. Stupid, stupid cow. Cows don't need grass. Yeah, you like your house here, cow? It's cool, huh? You'll love it. Just as soon as your mate comes in here, joins you, stupid cows. Why do I not have any torches? Damn it. Hey, dumbass. Come in here. Come on, cow. You can do it. For some reason, I have faith in you to be able to accomplish something. What is that sheep doing? I swear to God, if it jumps, I'm gonna go kill it. Come on in. Come into the full house. There you go. Okay. Hooray. Now then. Breed. Yay! We're not keeping them in there forever. Just for now. Now, what are you doing here? Hmm. May I ask? The Enderman's back, guys. Okay, well, you're just sitting here, so pickaxe to the head. And there goes his wool. We're just gonna grab the mutton on our way down. And whoa! Whoa. Alright. So we got another one that we weren't actually intending on getting. I forgot that they added that one. Repopulation and breed two cows. I just wanted to get the population started on them. Alright, so we gotta make cake. Cake, 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 cake. Hey, I got that other fence. Great. Oh, that's right. They changed the recipe for fences. Because they added all of the different types of wood for fences. Great. Alright, so we're going to make this cake, and that will do it for the episode here. So let's see if I can remember how to do it, guys. I don't remember how to do it. I think the milk actually has to go on top. Wheat on bottom. Is it two sugar and a one egg? Or... Yes! I wasn't sure if it was two sugar and one egg, or two eggs and one sugar. I always mix that up. Alright, cake! Aha! Portal reference speaking of which we will eventually be playing portal I know it's a little late I mean people played it so many times and everything but you know I haven't I've only played it a couple times <laughs> I've played it uh played portal once and portal two once so and I'll play it for you guys so that we can enjoy it um, but that will do it for us today guys I hope you did enjoyed the episode. If you did, please feel free to uh, leave a like. If you have any comments or suggestions, you can leave those in the comments section below. If you want to keep up to date with all of my videos, you can subscribe. And as always, I'm DemonFire93, and I'll see you guys next time.